Hi everyone, welcome back to Andy Gets Gas. I've been on hiatus for a few weeks here, um, dealing with some stuff, uh, but I am back and ready to go to gas stations, eat hot food, and review it. Save you time and money. Um, I'm going a little off book here today. Um, everything that was available in the hot rack, I had already uh, eaten and reviewed for you guys. Uh, so I got something from the cold case and microwaved it. So it's still hot food. It's not hot held though. Uh, it's cold held and microwaved to reheat. Uh, but that thing is the bacon and sausage cheddar and jack pretzel. Um, looks like it's got an egg on it too. Oh no, that's the pepper jack. Never mind. Uh, made with Jimmy Dean sausage right there in the package. Um, I don't know if I told you I'm at holiday. Um, I want to talk about this holiday for a little bit. First of all, um, it's off of Highway 7 between uh, Wood Hill. I think it's Wood Hill. Um, Wooddale and Louisiana. So to get here, you actually exit on Louisiana and you have to uh, wind around a, a roundabout real quick. Uh, it's a little bit of a backtrack. It's kind of tucked away. Like, it's perfectly visible from the highway, but then you have to come back to it. Um, it's also a very small store. Um, yeah, that's about it just complaining about nothing here um so let's dip into this real quick bacon and sausage cheddar and jack pretzel now i had a pretzel bun at uh speedway not too long ago it was also a breakfast sandwich with sausage and um it was pretty damn good so let's see how this matches up it's wet just like the other one was uh, uh, something about the pretzel buns they get like extra wet in the uh, paper wrapper. All right, let's. Well, pretty good size. This was two fifty nine. I want to say. Uh, I'm not entirely sure. Don't really remember. All right. So right away, you can see some nice melty. Uh, that's pepper jack. An American pepper jack. Uh, you can tell it came in a circle when I put it on. Um, pretzel smells pretty good. It actually, like, the pretzel smells like sausage on the top, and then it smells like bacon where the cheese is, um, which is because bacon is the next thing. Um, it's a round bacon, which I kind of like. Um, it's like the perfect size fills up the the bun pretty well um, even overhangs it a little bit uh, there's our Jimmy Dean sausage patty and no Jimmy Dean is not sponsoring this I never take a dime in sponsorship from uh, companies that I'm reviewing um, this is a very greasy sausage patty smells pretty good not very thick but if it's flavorful it doesn't need to be uh, and then there's the um, I guess that's cheddar a circle of cheddar um, that's not as melty that's fine uh, and then the underside of the bun looks like a like a happy face if you squint um, it's a nice spiral that's kind of cool like a little spiral on the top too almost like a hollow bread um, I know it's not that quality. It's a gas station pretzel bun. Um, but let's bite in and uh, see what's what. It's pretty good. That is pretty good. Um, even though the bacon's not crispy. Um, the sausage comes through, the bacon comes through, the cheeses are nice, that pepper jack adds just a little, little bit of heat to it, 
um, pairs really nicely with the bacon and the um, the sausage. The texture of the pretzel bun is good. It's also dried out. Um, it's just kind of greasy, um, but not too bad. Not too bad at all. Uh, there's some of those little um, hard bits in the sausage. Um, just like pieces of cartilage, that's fine. Now, the cheddar doesn't show up at all. They could have easily just used American for this, but I know why they did cheddar, and it's so they could charge a little bit more for it. Um, but it doesn't really factor in at all. This would be really good if it had an egg on it, um, like a scrambled egg. But the texture is good. Excuse me. It's chewy, it's soft, it's hot, there's a little bit of spice to it. Um, all in all, It's a pretty tasty sandwich. Um, I'd get this again. Uh, I'm curious to see how it holds up uh, on the hot rack. I don't know because I microwaved it and ate it right on the microwave. Um, I'm wondering if it gets soggy, if it dries out, you know how it how it holds up. But I'd get this again. This was a good deal. Um, <clears throat> warms you up, which is definitely needed today. Uh, my dashboard's saying one. AccuWeather say negative one. I'm sorry, negative two degrees. Um, we had something like a negative 40 wind chill this morning. Um, I think a few schools got canceled because it was too cold. But yeah, it was nice on a, on a cold day. So that was the bacon and sausage, cheddar and jack pretzel from holiday. Got my Red Bull. Um, and what's, what's breakfast without a little dessert? So I picked up the uh, holiday goodies to go. Marshmallow Crispy Bites uh, snack cup. Uh, 2.6 ounces. This was two dollars and nineteen cents. Looks like there's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven little bites in it. Just Rice crispy squares. Um, oh, it's wrapped. How the hell do I open it? Bear with me for a second. Oh, you're so tedious. Come on. Who are they trying to keep out of these things? Um, so, little Rice crispy square bites. They are all stuck together. Fantastic. Uh, we'll peel one off real quick. Oh, that's about how big they are. Uh, they fit in your cup holder, but my cup holders are full. Ah, uh, it smells 
tastes very artificial. It tastes very artificial. Not in a bad way, just like, you know this isn't good for you, but it never claimed to be. Number one ingredient is marshmallow. Then crisp rice. Uh, this is gluten free, by the way. Uh, zinc oxide. Nine niacinamide. Ferric orthophosphate. It's just iron. Oh, iron, zinc, niacin, butter, sugar, corn syrup, and high fructose corn syrup. So this contains more, um, oh, I'm sorry, that's all just added to the rice. So marshmallow, rice, butter, sugar, corn syrup, and high fructose corn syrup. I'm going to have another one. I shouldn't have eaten the whole thing in one bite. But yeah, that's pretty good. I mean, I understand the appeal of it. It's that handy cup holder container um, with little, you know, bites, goodies to go. Um, yeah, that's pretty good. The sandwich was the real star of the show here. Um, really the only thing I'm qualified to talk about. So, uh, I give a thumbs up to, uh, to the sandwich. Taste, texture, um, it said microwave for 40 seconds. I microwaved it for 40 seconds. It was a really good serving temperature. Um, it's just so weird that it's a little bit wet when you first unwrap it and then it dries out so quick. Um, it's good though. It's a, it's a quality sandwich. Um, that's about all I got. Um, yeah, it's good to be back. Any questions, comments, concerns, let me know. Anything you want to see me eat, let me know. And I will see y'all next time. Bye.